our last trip home would be about four-ish. And we would make a navigational error because on the corridor north of it was this enormous Russian aerodrome at Perleberg, right? So we'd give them an early wake-up call <laughs> and go <laughs> down about 50 feet and straight down their runway <laughs> and watch them all rushing about in all directions. And uh, <laughs> we didn't do that too often. And on other occasions, we would uh, <clears throat> make a navigational error, depending on our moods, I suppose. <laughs> and, uh, they used to putter about in there the, with a, oh, I've forgotten the name of the Russian type, but it was like a tiger moth. And I always remember it, a five-cylinder radial engine. And there were these two old chaps sitting in there, you know. <laughs> We would drop in front of him and blow him on his back <laughs> just to, you know, improve relationships.